this month is uh, the month of April is Limb Difference Awareness Month, yeah. and there's a word that's been coming up, and you're talking about the harm it causes, and that's ableism. Yeah. Can you talk to us about that? It's weird. Like as I said, I've been living in a Paralympic bubble, so and in in sporting world as well, I've never really noticed it. I've never noticed. Like I've I've obviously noticed it a little bit growing up, like ableism. And what ableism is, it's it's the it's treating someone differently because they're disabled and it could be a conscious thing or it could be an unconscious mm. thing and it's the presumption that someone is less because they're different mm. and I, I didn't really experience that a lot in the Paralympic world because that's what it is yeah. um, but I think in the past few months just having an experience outside of sport as well and, and meeting different people from all walks of life I actually noticed that people were talking to me differently than they talked to other people. Mm. And I actually, I couldn't understand what it was. And then for a while I was like, it's because of my arm. Like people can't look me in the eye and they yeah. can't talk to me. And, and people <laughs> would say like, oh, you're not disabled to me. Or I don't think of you as disabled because you mm. don't act like other disabled people. And I'm like, what is that supposed to mean? Yeah. That's so insulting. Yeah. Mm. And I identify as disabled because I am. And if mm. I don't, how is another little girl or little boy growing up going to be okay with who they are? Like, it's important for me to acknowledge yes. that I am disabled. I may not be as intensely disabled as someone else, but it's yeah. still part of me and who I am. And mm. I, still, I still face challenges in society because of my hand. Mm. And I have to use my voice and speak up for other people who suffer it more. Um, and I think just in the past few months, I was like, I really need to take, I really need to take ownership of this mm. a bit more. And I know I've, I've been quite open about being visible and using my position to kind of be in everyone's face and get everyone used to my body. But I think there's more that needs to be done because I was, I've been shocked at like how far behind Ireland is in terms of treating everyone equally.